Wow, guys, it has been exactly one year since my last Hot Rolls video. This one was a general update, and then this was the event that uh, came out, which was uploaded on January 27, 2022. What's uh, kind of funny, though, is that when you look at Tower Brawl's player count, it's almost getting ratioed by a fan-made game, Battlefront. It's weird, though, because the last update was on January 9th, 2023. So it was updated this year. I just don't know what exactly. If we look in the Discord server, which I highly advise not joining because it's a total cesspool, but the last update on the game updates was 7-4-2022. This was the overall game changes, which removed the Winter 22 update and Tower Rebalancing. January 2017 was the last event, so it has been a year, a full-on year since Tower Brawl's last event. Ah oh, man, the good times of Tower Brawl's when this game was alive before Tower Defense Simulator's time. And then TDS just pretty much stole the show. Why is the tank down that much? It looks really stupid. Wow, those zombies are kind of lagging. They're kind of glitching back and forth. For a game being this old, I thought Planet would fix that, but no, they're still quite buggy. So yeah, this game's code is not that great compared to you know uh other td games i'm not gonna list any of <laughs> mine <laughs> but nonetheless this is the father of all td games without tower battles tds wouldn't exist my game wouldn't exist no other game would exist dude i'm just gonna do it one v one like i used to all, all the time <sighs> always going to the classics midnight road i've been i filmed so many videos there's there's even one in the uh thumbnail dude of the of the classic map yeah this is a map that we both didn't want um i think there's a new map i haven't seen this one before nice get my little jeep down my little patrol um you guys don't know planet earth just generally has a busy life now i think he has like a job in real life he can't just solely rely off of Roblox DevX, I guess. Uh, I think the entire time he was using this game to pay off his college stuff, and now that has been completed, he now goes to work. So I would expect how I also not get updates frequently either. A common complaint I hear about though is that why doesn't Planet Earth just simply hire more devs and uh, stuff like that? Um, I'm actually not sure why he doesn't do that. That would be the most reasonable thing to do is to hire devs to fix your game and things like that. But he just chose not to do that and still refuses to do that. The only thing he'll have is like map builders and things like that, but no sort of pro programmers on this game, which is what he really needs. He left. He ha he had to go. I win. I'm a winner. Winners. Although I still got to beat the game, so beer, beer. Winner. Winners. Versus mode is actually kind of stupid because I remember some guy beat me with just this one tower and I'm about to do the same thing. It's pretty unbalanced and needs to be fixed, but I don't think Planet cares. I play some Jeep man. Okay, this is a lazy part. Just spam this and I win. This guy like just has a flamethrower and he, he doesn't even know what to do for the first boss. Oh, wait, he put, put that commando. I'm still gonna spam though. I don't care. Oh man, this guy has farms. He's selling as far as no. He's gonna he's gonna beat me down with two commandos. Uh, actually, I actually might lose to the stuff guys that he doesn't have any response for. Thing is, it's only like 60 health right there, so I'm sitting in speedy. So hopefully get like at least four more damage in. Come on, Speedy, Speedies, come on, make it stop dying. Come on, or I mean, the boss one works, but come on, Speedies. I'm praying for Speedies right now. Come on, bro. Okay, yeah, I brought itself down to 11, so that clearly wasn't enough. Okay, yeah, we're good. We got that boss one going there. He finally did get cell detection, but with all the spam lined up, it's just not going to do well. Oh, he's going to die by these few Speedies. Oh, wait, five health. Yeah, she, yeah, he's just gonna move his stuff all the way over here. He didn't get stealth detection, though. He bought, he, he could have afforded stealth detection, I think, but he, he didn't do that. Dude, these two are gonna kill you now. I think he, sh he stole his other commando. He's trying to sue it for stealth, but I don't think he's gonna be able to afford that. And... What a stupid victory. Easy. All right, I want to see what Tower Battle's Battlefront is about. Welcome to Tower Battle's Battlefront. This game experience what it's like to be a tower zombie from the from the Tower Defense game, Tower Battles. It's a really weird boss three positioning on that rock. That's not normal. And they made Planet Earth uh, with giant rocket pods and, and have some weird void thing. My uh, first experience with this game is getting kicked because I didn't kill the boss in time when I didn't even get to play the game. I uh, I just keep getting kicked from the game. There's there's other people here. I don't know if they're playing a the game or getting the same thing. This is really a stupid ass design. If it if it 
kicks you out because you die to the boss. Wow, wow, what a really cool game. I can't I can't even play this my this is my fourth time rejoining. Alright, if present day Tower Balls has has issues with it and it's still kinda old, how bad is old Tower Balls? Um Oh man, this game brings back good memories with the song in the back as well. It's a shame I don't have my usual loadout. I'm poor. There's also never a Golden Z in game. I started playing around 2017, but I didn't get the badge, but I for sure got the 2018 badge. Guess I'll play myself with my scout and sniper loadout. All right, cool, military base. Oh man, look at the uh, secret wave guy. I, I remember that. Yeah, this feels like the classic one, all right. <laughs> the goddamn Call of Duty uh, perk. Hmm, zombies also have a little funny walk animation to them. Visibility. Uh, he he already has visibility. I don't. I, I think mean extended range would make more sense. Wow, look at these APCs. They just look crappy. <laughs> and, and and there's also like a SWAT truck or transport vehicle as well. Fellas, back in the day, this was top of the line tower defense game right here, dude. I believe this is the only really solid tower defense game at the time. No other T TD game was this good, which is saying a lot considering how well even today's standards is just not that good. Yeah, we can start to see its automation issues already glaring right here. The old TP would do this a lot where not even that many zombies and we start to lag a bit. Games such as Tower Defense Simulator and also my game can handle thousands at a time with no problem. This game is just simply outdated. A relic from the past. The zombies look funny when they walk in a straight line. You know, I really wish Tower Battles kept updating, you know? Maybe it could have really had a hard chance against TDS, but... Yeah, they kind of dropped the ball. Well, Planet really dropped the ball of this game. It, it was always on the, you know, most popular section of TD games and just simply didn't update that much. And, you know, other TD games came along and stole that show. But it's probably a better move for Planet as he has a stable long-term career, I guess. Finally max up my scout. Wow, that looks like crap because it only fires out of one gun, not two. Oh, man, the old max out UI. I really miss this game, dude. I really wish that it didn't fall off. I I really wish that Planet would have kept it up, hired new devs, really made it into a bigger game, dude. I would have loved to see that, but what was once the king is now the biggest meme, dude. It, it sucks. Wow. Wow, that, uh, the way they spawn is just terrible. My god. I think it's also had a higher chance of boss one back then. Uh, as you can see, you got two of them now. Just, just look at the way they walk, man. Look at that. That's, that's not normal. That looks stupid. Ah, yes, the old necromancer. Let's see what he does when he spawns and stuff. Does it also look dumb? Yep, it, it, yeah, it lo looks dumb. I'm gonna try to survive as long as I can with these towers. I don't think I'm gonna make it that far though. <laughs> wow, three boss. Oh, make it four boss ones. Whoa. Four was enough, so we got five. Five was enough, so we got six. Wow, six boss ones. I'm gonna lose. I was trying to save up for this guy, but I can't. I gotta place down another sniper. Yeah, yeah, I really doubt I'm gonna win with this. I lost a max. Ah, I lost a max scout in the front. Now I put it in the back. All right, our first twenty, our first loss. Nice. How the hell are we supposed to defeat that? I believe that is game. I don't think I can kill this. Look at the boss one. Look how they just slantily go up as if they're like somehow on a ramp. I I have four level four snipers. I don't think that's gonna be enough. It's basically doing 24 DPS, which is garbage. And, and more mysteries, yeah. Uh, good game. Never mind, this game sucks. We finally killed the boss too. Holy! We killed the boss too. That's a raw record right there, dude. Can we defeat these shabby boss ones, please? Come on, sniper, do it. Damn it. Okay, we took some damage. Now it's on to molten guys or lava. Oh, cool. Stealth boss. We lose. Yep. Yep. That stealth boss is going to punch right through all of that. Cool, cool. And... Now we die. Oh. That was a throwback to Tower Battles. I don't think I'm gonna make another video on this game again, unless it gets, you know, some sort of boss update or new tower, but other than that, I don't really want to come back to this.